changed our community here at Hillel Day School in Farmington Hills, Michigan. All the way in Michigan. You know where that is on the map? Yes, we do. All right. Yeah. Cool. All right. We take it you're a Michigan State fan as well. Uh, sorry, we're Penn Staters. <laughs> This is Jacob, and he wants to know how did you get the money for the bench? How do we get the money? You can say that you helped. I would have ordered it with you. Huh? He wants to know about the lights. You can let him know that you and I ordered it from our school funds. Um, we ordered it uh, from our school funds. Um, like, so they have enough money, like. For the buddy bench. Very cool. You know, Christian, we're today actually, when we get off the phone with you here, we're actually having a bake sale for our entire school. We're a um, ECC, which is a child, early childhood center through eighth grade school. And so we are having a bake sale for our entire school to raise money for three benches because we have three playgrounds. And so we wanted to know where you got your money from. So we're going to. Um, we're going to hopefully raise enough money, and if we don't get enough, the school is going to chip in the rest of it so that we can get these benches on our playgrounds quickly. That That's awesome, and uh, we're kind of lucky. I don't know if you have um, rewards programs there in Michigan, but we have things through our supermarket and actually the Target store where we get money back every so often, and that's how we uh, use that money to go back to the kids to uh, make Christian's Hope and dream come true, right? Yeah. Very cool. Very but that's cool. awesome that you're having a bake sale. Very yeah. cool. We actually made every single baked good that we're selling. We've been cooking and baking for the last two days with all the parents, and so it's been really fun. All right, Nicolette, come on up. Well, just save me a couple. All save right. All right. How's that sound? Go ahead. What's the way you made out of? Um, it's made out of wood and plastic. And do you guys, do you guys have uh, the kind of weather we have there? Has it been able to sustain the snow? Yeah, so far it's been it's been holding up pretty well. It's pretty sturdy, um, but when we we got hit pretty hard with snow, harder than usual. <laughs> yeah, I think you did. So, Mr. Miller and I will connect about maybe the kind of bench you have, because maybe we can follow in your footsteps with that bench too. Absolutely. All right, go ahead. Are you using the bench yet? Um. Yeah. Well, yeah, I was, yeah, I've seen other kids on the bench, and I saw other kids um, going to that person. Hey, tell them how they do. How are the three ways that you use it? Tell them. Um, and the three way we have three ways to use it. Um, one is for a person will go sit on the bench, um, and the another person will go over and ask if they want to like. Um, play a game. Um, the other, 
another idea is um they go um yeah they one person goes over to ask that the person on the bench if they want to like talk um and the last idea is that um one kid two kids are sitting on the bench and one looks over and um sit and says do you want to um, walk or talk with me. Very cool. Those are great ways to use the bench. All right. How did your parents feel when they heard about the idea? Sorry, hon, we didn't hear that part of your question. It was cutting in and out. How did Can you ask again? Christian, how did your parents feel about your idea when you told them about it? I'm sorry, we missed that again. How did your parents feel about your idea, Christian? Oh. Um, they feel they felt proud um, of me because, like, I like went up to Mr. Miller and told him uh, about the bloody bench, and they're just proud that um, like their uh, other schools are um, getting one, like, because of my idea. You're an inspiration, buddy. You sure are. All right, next. What was the most? What was the most exciting thing about making the buddy bench? So, what's been the most exciting experience that you've had so far since you started this whole buddy bench thing? The most exciting thing about doing Um. Like, have you met anyone cool that you really wanted to meet or anything like that? Um, I think the most exciting thing is that, like, um, I, I'm seeing, like, a lot of kids going over to, like, one kid on the bench. Like, there's, like, five kids who go over to the one kid, like, at a time. Mm -hmm. Have you met anyone famous because of the bunny bench? <laughs> Um, news reporters. Yeah, I've met lots of news reporters, and I'm going to California soon, so I'm going to meet like other kids um, who had good ideas for their school. Very nice. Okay. Um, have you made friends from the buddy bench? Have you made any friends from the buddy bench? Um, have you gone over and used it with anyone's buddy? Well, I already saw, like, I, since I see other kids, um, since I see other kids on the bench, um, I usually let them, like, like, meet that person on the bench, um, so, like, they get the feeling, um, for, like, what they're supposed to do for the buddy bench. I want to, I want to answer part of that question for you, too, though, dear, and just say that since Christian shared his idea with the rest of the school, a lot of the other kids will come up to him in the hallway and say thank you for your great idea or they'll give him a high five or a handshake and uh, I think that makes you feel pretty special, right? Yeah. That's awesome. All right. Kristen, how old are you? Uh, I'm eight. Are you, how old are you? Um, that's how old I am. Um, my first, it, my birthday is August 31st, wait, August 30th, so. So you'll be nine this summer. Yeah. yeah. What, what grade are you in? I'm in second grade. Oh, so I'm in second grade, too. We are all second graders here. Very fun. All right. We're asking personal questions now. No more buddy bench questions. We want to know about you now, Christian, OK? Basketball team name is Dominators. Um, 
for swim team um, or just the Central York Panthers. Um, uh, for soccer, we were uh, I think Panthers. And um, oh, well, baseball. Um, or like. We don't, I don't know our team name now because I'm not playing right now. Um, it's too cold. I, I play baseball and I switch teams every year. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to Thank you. Hi, Kristen. Um, what are your hobbies? Your hobbies? Um, collect anything. Um, I, I like to, um, build Legos, um, uh, I like, um, trains, and, um, I like playing on my iPod Touch when I'm at home. I think a lot of they have similar interests as well, Christians. Yeah, Mark likes to Okay, thanks, sweetie. All right. Thanks, friends. Do you like me? Yeah. Do you have a favorite book? Uh, my favorite book is, oh, I like um, Diary of the Wimpy Kids series. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. All right. They like it. That's a good one, too, around here. All right. What kind of video games do you like? What kind of video games do you like? Um, I like to play um, Minecraft on my iPod Touch. Um, I like to play Madden 25. Um, I also like to play FIFA 14. Christian, just so you know, you, you and these kids were all in the same school. I think you'd have a lot yeah, of friends. I'm pretty, um, yeah, right away. <laughs> together. Awesome. Very cool. Yeah. All right. Um, our last question for you. Uh, our last question for you, Christian. What's your favorite color? Um, my favorite color is blue. blue. Yes! So, Christian, so we, that is all the questions we have for you. Actually, we had probably about 200 more questions, but we had to limit it because we have a feeling we need to get back to class. Do you have any questions for us, buddy? Um, no. No? Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, Mr. Miller, this has been an absolute And if I could just say yes. uh, just a little message to all the friends out there. Um, I'm really proud of the work that you're doing, too. And this is just an example of one person having a great idea, and I know that every single one of you that's sitting there has an awesome idea too that's just waiting to come to life and to happen. And uh, we had a special assembly this morning about peace and Martin Luther King. And we said this morning a lot of times that we need more peace in our world. So I hope that your idea is a peaceful one and I hope that you find and look for ways for more peace in our world. Thank so thank you for Skyping thank you with so us, much. and uh, good luck on your bench. And please keep in touch and let us know when it's on the playground. Okay, well, I just want to say thank you a lot. Bye. 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 Bye.